most of the research is about white male. There is massive bias. When people talk about autism, ADHD in man and female, male and female, diagnostically, there is no difference. But the difference is, is about how different they are as a gender. For example, the female hormones, again, in, in around the menstrual cycle, as the, the hormone levels dip, the female hormone dip, so does the dopamine. And people who have got ADHD, females have got ADHD, that becomes, that worsened during that time. But again, along with that, there's a social responsibility. We don't talk about that social dis- responsibility. We talk about the disparity between male and female, but actually the society has created those those kind of models for males and females. When when you're a female, you're expected to mask, you're expected to confirm, you're expected to kind of act in a certain way. You have to be polite. So this societal pressure has created the, the disparity and we hardly talk about it. Thank this you. Is, yeah, yeah, societal pressures definitely put differences on each gender and, and even cultures and stuff like that. There's obviously oh, yes. also... Um, men that would relate to the sort of, I guess, stereotypical female experience too. Yeah. Is that right? Because yes. some, some men do really heavily mask. I know the hormones are different, but Ooh, I think, yes. yeah, it's not necessarily fully gendered, right? It's more about how society yeah. treats those genders. Uh, society, exactly. 